Going investigation involving Zeke Rewards. Investors are desperately trying to get their money back. Of course, we're talking about the Lexington company, Zeke, shut down by the Securities and Exchange Commission. Zeke Rewards is being called a $600 million Ponzi scheme. This evening, Fox 8 Chick is Strickland on what you need to do now to get your money back. Maxine Owen took her family and friends' word that investing in Zeke Rewards was a sure bet. She lost $2,000. And the only reason I had the $2,000 after it saved ahead for my insurance and taxes. Kenneth Bell, a D.C. lawyer, is in charge of getting people like Owen their money back. During a news conference Monday, he laid out his plan to make sure people get paid. And I see it as my job to collect and hold every dollar that can be found from anyone who ought not have it as a result of this Ponzi scheme. He says they will put a claim form on the website ZekeRewardsReceivership.com so people can report their loss, but it'll take a while before they get a refund. We have our hands on a substantial amount of funds already and I think we can quickly grab quite a bit more. Bell calls Zekeler a Ponzi scheme, but not everyone is convinced. A Facebook page in favor of Zeke Rewards asks for donations for a legal defense fund. An email from ZekeLegal at gmail.com says, quote, our goals are simple. First, protect every one of us by first proving that Zeke was not a Ponzi scheme. Second, by assisting Paul Burke to reopen Zeke Rewards, allowing all of us to continue making money. And last, to prevent the government from keeping all the money that we use to purchase bids with and the money we have received or is pending in one of the e-wallets. As for Owen, she says she won't give them one more dime. I think it's terrible that they're asking for more money. They must think people are crazy. In Lexington, Sheikah Strickland, Fox 8 News. Well, the attorney in charge of the receivership says the best thing people can do right now is stop contacting him. He says he's just overwhelmed with thousands of emails and phone calls and he wants to use all the time he can to get the money back. Well, one down, a hundred